This is the place. What? Up the Kyber Pass. There's nothing but, but dirt and rocks and sand. And the sun. Oh, just because you have this idea of being specially chosen by God, it doesn't mean that it's true. Like, what's here? Nothing. God. God is here. Ah, God is everywhere. <laughs> Not here, Dad. This is God's forsaken wilderness. Oh, don't say that, son. Do you know where we are? No. Do you? Mount Moriah. Ah, this will be the heart of a great city, oh. the center of our nation. Yeah? And what will it be called? Oh, I don't know. You don't know. Hello? Salam? I know, I know. It'll be called Salam. If you want, Jerry. Don't be so <laughs> pages. What about Jerry Salam? This is a place of great significance, Mount Moriah. We were told to come here. God told you to come here. Yep. And to bring me? Oh, absolutely. So you told me that we were going to go hunting by the sometime, you know, in the mountains for a bit, that are hunting. But we did, didn't we? You mean those sheep we caught? You couldn't get a fire going, so we half-charred ribs and raw cinders. <sighs> Look, I'm a prophet, not a celebrity chef. <laughs> <laughs> well, you should have made like Moses. Got us a bush burning. <laughs> We're having a good time. I mean, aren't you having a good time? Yeah. Quality time. I wouldn't say that exactly. Look, it is good to get out of town, you know? Get some fresh air away from all the cabin salesmen and the usurers and stuff. Oh, those usurers are pits. Yeah. Better fresh air, you know? Reality check. Time to figure out who I am. Who am I? You know, I got big plans for the future, and you might not be part of them. Do you think about the future? Yes, and it's 
excuse me, but you don't feature him in the whole lot. I mean, you got to admit the 85-year age gap between us is a bit much, you know? <laughs> the whole world out there, you know? There must be literally thousands of people in it. I want to go and be part of that. People who say that usually end up as usurers. No, 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 no. You're missing the point. I need freedom. My own personal freedom, you know. I can't be tied to the old ways. If we just do what's expected of us, then we're as good as dead. You've got to have some vision. Oh, I have vision. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but that comes from God. Or at least you think it does. I'm talking about me, personal vision. That comes from me. Son, or Satan. Yes, God, Satan. They're all just ideas that are expressed through people. You know, you look at me, you might see good, you might see evil, but without me, without people, God could never have any meaning. <laughs> you say that it's God who needs people? <laughs> I'm saying... Maybe you should get those voices in your head checked. There might be more to it than what they're saying. Hmm? You know, I worry about you, Dad. You seem kind of stressed out. You know, why don't you take some time off? Mum's at home. You know, she gets lonely. And she's a fair bit younger than you are. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. I just mean... Don't you think you deserve a little time off? Time to enjoy things? And I'm sure that would fit in with God's wishes. Ha! You don't know anything about God's wishes. What I can tell you is that God has terrible, dark plans for you and I. Yes, I know. There's nothing easy about being your son. Hmm? All right, enough of the smart ass. It's about time we got down to business. Business? Business? What business could we possibly get down to out here? Hmm? Business that will be remembered throughout human history. Business that will inspire business that will show people the true meaning of faith. Yeah. This is the last place you come to show anyone faith, or anything else for that matter. Oh, you're so wrong. Down there in the town, faith is easy, where it just comes on its earthly plan. Real faith shows up here, where it's dark, desolate and dangerous, with fear and trembling. The challenge is your faith. But my faith is intact. <clears throat> Even in the face of life and death. Death. Even in the face of death and sacrifice. Sac sacrifice. Even in the face of terrible loss. Ross, you've lost the plot. That's what you've lost. Death, sacrifice, loss. Hey, you didn't come out and kill yourself, did you? Come, kill yourself. No, 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 no way. I wasn't thinking of that. I wasn't coming to kill myself. Well, that's a relief. You know, actually, was there anyone else you were thinking of killing? You know? It's this is a bit weird. <laughs> Dad? Isaac, my dear son. <clears throat> what? What? Are you planning what I think you're planning? Please. 
I don't want to have to do this. Don't take it personally. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, what? Okay, okay. <laughs> I am resigning if my position is your son. I'm fucking out of here. Don't make this more difficult oh. for me. What? Your argument was inconsequential. And if, if I have had to go through with it, I would have. <laughs> ah, let's, uh, let's go and get that rag. Let's go, go, go. You really are out of your mind. And I'm out of your mind. What are you doing? Voguing? <laughs> Trying to slaughter you! Oh, that. You'll get used to it. Your wicked thoughts are under external influence. Let's stand the procedure. <laughs> <laughs> You're saying that the dark is stopping me from killing you. 
I'm still standing here, son. Do the maths. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Bob. Thank you, Bob. Let's find your ram and get the hell out of here. Whatever God wants. Ha! You're starting to get the idea. You'll make a great prophet yourself someday. Oh. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ? At least 3,000 years in the future. You're a natural son. <laughs> <laughs>